when I won the Olympic Games, the emotions were, that were going through my head were just, oh, it's over, it was relief. And breaking the world record was like, oh my God, I finally did something great. Aries Merritt, the world's fastest man in the 110 meter hurdles, is getting ready for a comeback year. Eight years ago, he won gold in the London Games and set the world record. It's a record that still stands today. Merritt, a University of Tennessee track alum, barely missed the 2016 Olympics after getting a kidney transplant from his sister. It's an incredible story. The 2020 Tokyo Olympics was supposed to be his comeback year but COVID-19 derailed it last summer. In a story you will see only here on 4, we talk with Merritt about the steps he's taken to get back on the main stage. It's the comeback year for the comeback athlete. I'm just excited to get back out there and see what happens. After a year of unknowns, Olympian Aries Merritt is training for his final Olympics. I don't think that my body can handle another four year cycle, so this is definitely my farewell song for the Olympic Games. Eight years ago, the University of Tennessee alum won gold in the 2012 London Olympics, and weeks later, he went on to set the world record in the 110 meter hurdles. I won every major championship I competed in that year. I won Olympic gold, and then three weeks later after that, I broke the world record, and it was just a great year. They called it a magical season. His coach, Andreas Baim, has been there for the last 13 years. I think it's a very special and unusual relationship and situation to be coaching an athlete for that extended period of time. And during those 13 years, Aries battled a deadly kidney disease before getting a kidney transplant from his sister. My sister was one of the first people I called. She immediately went and got tested to see if she would be a match. After recovering from the transplant, Aries knew his chances of getting to the 2016 Olympics were slim. I missed it by 0.01, despite having not trained in a very long time. After 2016, Aries knew he had one more chance to win gold, the 2020 Tokyo Olympics, but he had to overcome injuries, a cancer diagnosis for his mother, and then the COVID pandemic, which pushed the games back to 2021. Even if this is my last time running or my last year running, you know, I, I had a great career. I've won the world title. I've won the Olympic title. I've broken the world record. I've done pretty much everything you can do in the sport. It would be the height of a very historic career. I'm Marius Payton, News for Nashville. Oh, are we wishing him well? Oh, absolutely. Beautiful story. That's going to do it for News 4 at 4. Yeah, Marius Payton standing by right now with more on News 4 at 5.